we're going to take a quick look at skinning now. And like everything else in this quick start guide, there's a lot more to it than what I'm going to show you. But this is just to get you started. Where I'm at now is I'm in Daz Studio. And what I'm looking at is a freebie from over at Renderosity. It's the Major for Genesis 8 female. And I have the jacket. I don't have the Genesis 8 female loaded or anything like that. In fact, I'll show you, all I have is just the jacket loaded. And then what you do from here is you just File, Export. As you can see, I'm just going to click on Jacket. I've already exported it. I'm not going to worry about anything other than to make sure one unit equals one centimeter, which it should already be set on. And then that's all we're going to do from DAS. Now back over in Character Creator 3, we're going to come to Create Cloth Hair Accessories. And then we're going to go ahead and import that jacket. Now it's not going to come in perfectly on center, mainly because this jacket wasn't built to fit this. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to come in here and select the character, go to in. I'm going to make sure mirror is selected. And I'm going to roll these down into the sleeves just a little better. You don't have to be perfect at this, you just got to kind of split the difference. And it's, it might not work. You might find some things that are, are just built uh, too differently for it to work on. Next thing I'm going to do is I just like to move the pivot up. So you come down here and you can move your pivot anywhere you want by just clicking there. You can use your pivot down at the bottom if you want to. It's pretty much whatever you want to do. We're just going to set this in here. You just, like I said, you just kind of split the difference. And you may have to do this a couple of times to see how it's going to work. And now in this case, uh, this bra is not going to be under it. I would go ahead and take it out so it can at least fit the skin. And then what we're ready to do now is come over here to transfer skin weights. It's already on what we need for default. Hit apply. Now you're going to sit there and say, wow, that doesn't look too good. Well, we got to go to conform. Calculate collision. That's going to take care of a lot of your problems. If calculate collision doesn't handle it, then you may have some problems getting the clothing to actually fit. Or you may have to go in and manipulate the character more to the clothing. Now we're getting better there, but we can also come in here and increase our size. And that, basic, that is basic skinning right there. You can move in one at a time and you can manipulate it easily uh, by just coming in and skinning one feature at a time. A bodysuit can be a little dif difficult. If it's got the feet on it, I'd give it up. Sometimes that can be almost impossible. I do not do the gloves. I've yet to have really very many successful uh, gloves come over because the hands are just too different. But... As you can see, this works well, and it works and makes a nice uh, figure once you convert it all the way over. It makes a nice character. 